Okay, the elevator door is the goal. Try and score on me. Yeah! Yeah! All right, it's noon. We're going home. See you later, boss genie. Succulent bossing Jakey. I'm gonna go home and stuff my goose. Wait, boil powder. What is that powder? I don't know. I don't know. What do we do? Okay, everyone, we are in lockdown, which means no one can come in or out of the precinct. Now, apparently, three other precincts received similar packages this month, and they were all baking powder. Nevertheless, Hazmet has to run a quick test, but I anticipate we'll all be out of here momentarily. In the meantime, I suggest we turn this lockdown into a poppin' lockdown, right? Am I right? Huh? Okay, so I'll keep everyone updated and keep working on your dance moves. Jake. What are you doing? This is a crisis. I'm trying to keep morale up because Hazmat said it's almost definitely a hoax. Almost? What if it's anthrax? We are all 100% gonna die. Guys, you're freaking people out. Can you please calm it down? We're doing fine here. I'm not Hitchcock. He got trapped out on the balcony. I don't like him alone out there, not with his history. I mean, what if he gets up on a ledge? What, you think he's gonna jump? No, he's just always falling off things. He's got a worm living in his ear that affects his balance. Oh, well, then he's not truly alone out there. Right? Okay, I'm gonna call Holt. You wanna come? Yeah. Too bad, you're not invited. I'm in charge. Bye! All right, everyone, calm down. Just calm down. Let us out, or I'm gonna stop breaking things. This is a human rights violation. You can't keep us here. I'm 23, I'm a celebrity, and today I'm gonna die. Not one word of that is true. Ow! Oh, Hitchcock's bleeding. He got hit in the head with a soda can. He never saw it coming. Jake, we have to start putting people in detention. We have to quash this. No, we need them to calm down. We need to put on Something's Gotta Give. Great idea. Great movie. Also, we should probably put out that fire. So, Captain, I have some news. What happened? Well, remember when you told me not to burn down the precinct? You burned down the precinct? No, I had the fire put out almost immediately. This is a success story. Tell me exactly what happened. Well, it started with Boyle wanting to say the word succulent. Oh no. And it ended with a small riot in which a dirtbag set Hitchcock's nap couch on fire. Enough. Jeffords and I will come right away. I'm very disappointed in you. What's he saying? He said he's very disappointed in you. Oh man. You wanted to see me? Yeah. I know you're too proud to say I told you so, so I'm just gonna- Told you so. Not too proud. Yeah, it seems right. Look, I screwed up, and I think you should take over command of the precinct. Been waiting to hear you say that all day? I know. Which is why you shouldn't say it. Huh? You're still trying to make people happy. Don't apologize to me. Be a leader and tell me what you need me to do. Tell everyone what you need them to do. You're the captain, Jake. I'm the captain now. Captain Phillips. Captain Phillips! That's what it was. Look at me, look at me, right? Yeah. All right, guys, listen up. All right, listen up, people. Boyle, you're no longer my number two. <sighs> what did you say to him, Amy? You've been after my job this whole time. It's not Amy. I don't need a Tinkerbell. I need you to find out where that powder came from. Scully, I need you to help Boyle. Don't worry about Hitchcock, he'll be fine. I once saw him fall down three flights of stairs, get up and keep eating his hot dog like nothing happened. You're right. He's the strongest man we know. No. Gina, I know you're scared, but you gotta stop freaking out the civilians. Yes, I am very influential. And Diaz, you need to stop making fun of Gina and help her. Fine. All right, everyone, listen up. I know this is tough to hear, but we still don't know what that powder is, and we may be here for a while yet. Also, the copy room is now a detention center for anyone who gets out of line. This is a police station in a lockdown, not a summer camp. Ooh, should we play capture the flag? Jake. Right. Stay tuned for more details. That'll be all for now. I have news, everyone. The powder was not harmful. Molly! <laughs> oh, I gotta say, that's pretty sweet. Oh, the door closed behind him. Now they're both locked outside. What happened? What's going on? Lockdown's officially over. Squad's heading home for Thanksgiving. I don't understand. Last I heard, the precinct was on fire, and we wouldn't get lab results for another three hours. Boyle sped things up. I noticed an IT guy we fired two years ago in surveillance footage. Turns out, he was also fired from the other precincts. ESU raided his home and found Bacillus streptomu... Kokomo. I can't pronounce it. Regardless, he confessed, and it wasn't poisonous. All right. It seems like you turned it around. 
Yeah, actually, we're trying to clean up here, Captain, so unless you have something meaningful to contribute, you can get the hell out. Oh, right, sorry, you weren't here when I switched up my management style. That must be so confusing for you. Anyways, everyone head on home. Happy Thanksgiving, guys. Jake. Happy Turkey Day, guys. I'll be in my office. <laughs> <laughs>